Part two, it's up ahead on the left side of our shuttle. We call it the Earful Tower. It's inspired by the water tower Walt Disney had built for his Burbank studio in 1939. Our Florida tower stands a lucky 13 stories high, and we added our own creative touch, a giant set of Mickey Mouse ears. If you wanted to wear those ears, you'd have to have a hat size of 342 and 3 eighths. Up ahead, after the next bend in the road, you'll have a perfect opportunity to take a picture of this famous icon. In the world of entertainment, every project starts with a screenplay and a lot of creative ideas. A production studio is where the ideas of writers, producers, and directors are transformed into an on-screen reality. Within these huge spaces, filmmakers can literally create their own worlds. Our Florida sound stages are soundproof, weatherproof, and most importantly, air-conditioned. All vitally important for the cast, crew, and equipment. Many of the crafts needed for filmmaking are located right here on the lot. On the left, we have our own green department. It grows flowers, trees, shrubs, and topiaries. A few well-placed plants can cover up empty spots in the set and add a touch of natural beauty to a scene. On the right are two of the aircraft from the 2001 blockbuster hit Pearl Harbor. These exact full-scale replicas of P-40 fighters were used in a special effect fight sequence. Of course, many of the planes we saw flying through the aerial battles were sitting on the ground weren't real at all. They were created entirely within a computer. Oh, keep your cameras focused to the right. We're coming up in that perfect angle of the Earful Tower I told you about. It's a true masterpiece. <laughs> We're entering one of our most glamorous and colorful departments, creative costuming. Every star has to have just the right wardrobe, and it all begins here with a designer's sketch. Our team of designers, seamstresses, and tailors can turn one and a half million yards of fabric into over 25,000 costumes every year. Many of these costumes will become part of the shows and attractions of the Walt Disney World Resort. In fact, here in Florida, we have the largest working wardrobe department in the world. Why, Mickey Mouse alone has over 175 different outfits to choose from, while Minnie Mouse keeps more than 200 unique costumes in her wardrobe. On the left are costumes worn by the stars in recent studio productions. You'll probably recognize some of those costumes from the big screen. Every story needs a setting, and our design staff can create just about any place a script calls for, from an urban city street to a remote desert canyon. On the left is our scenic shop where large-scale sets and props are built. Our team of set designers, carpenters, artists, and engineers has created caves and caverns, game show sets, even replicas of the U.S. Supreme Court and NASA's Mission Control, all on our sound stages. The shop also provides sets and props for our shows and parades here at Walt Disney World. The same skill and craftsmanship that goes into a movie set can also be used to create magic for our parks. Either way, it's all about making dreams come true. How much curiosity is that? About what? Only one reason they were now we're getting some control. It's They've done space movies. Yeah. Oversized props and vehicles. Cars, trucks, boats, planes. We often save these props in case we need them for future productions. In this backlog collection, you may find real working vehicles, non-working mock-ups, and even large-scale miniatures used in special effects shots. Large-scale models create a more convincing illusion on camera. We even place small cut-out passengers in the windows of the plane. Yeah. We're now passing by the sets for our lights, motors, action, extreme stunt show. On the left, you may catch a glimpse of the Mediterranean fishing village that sets the stage for this thrilling attraction. We'll get a closer look at it soon, but for now, we're approaching one of the largest standing sets on our back lot. It's over on the right. It may not look like much from this angle, but it's pretty spectacular on the other side. This is great, folks. The production crew has just given us clearance to enter the set. Hello, Backlot Tour. I'm Amy, a production coordinator here at the studios. I can see your shuttle heading toward our canyon set. I've given your driver permission to come in and take a look around. I'm up here with our effects crew, and we're getting ready to shoot a test sequence. Oh, on the way in, you're going to be crossing a wooden bridge, and things may get a little bumpy. So please, hold on to your belongings especially hats, cameras, and glasses, and keep an eye on any small children in your party. And of course, please remain seated at all times. Welcome to the set. As you can see, we brought the bare, dry deserts of Southern California to green, typically humid, Central Florida. This set is based on real locations that are productive. 
production designer took pictures of. Our set crew spent about six months building the canyon, but we've used it for a number of TV shows and specials over the years. For our upcoming production, the script called for a tanker truck. We found this one in our boneyard, yard, but it was too big to drive into place. So we picked it up with a crate and set it down here. We're up on the overhead platforms and I see our director has arrived. As soon as the rain effect is ready, we'll begin the sequence. This sudden shower is really just a special effect. We've rigged up a series of water nozzles just above your tram. The water sprays in a crisscross pattern to create a sense of depth. But this storm only covers the first few feet of the set. Is that
speeds up to 7 miles an hour before making their high-speed entrances onto the stage for our lights, motors, action extreme stunt show. But first, these are professional stunt drivers. We hope you'll enjoy their daring driving skills. Don't try them yourself. On the way, we've reached our second ball. Take all the time you like. Please stay seated until our travel 